Hello world and all who inhabit it, my name is Minish May and welcome back to more Explorers of Sky Randomizer. In the last episode, we beat the game, we beat Dialga, and we did have to say goodbye to Pele. But now we're back, and we're gonna- we're gonna tackle this, and we're gonna see what happens. That was the worst intro ever, but you know, it's whatever. We're gonna do the post game before jumping into the next game, because in my opinion, the post game is like, just as good as the main story. So, let's see what adventures await Miel and Pele now. As a result of Miel and Pele's heroic actions, the destruction of time was stopped, and peace returned to the world of Pokemon. Of course, not everything returned to normal right away. Some places remained where time was still out of control, but overall, things were becoming better everywhere. As for Miel and Pele, they returned to Wigglytuff's guild, and fell back into their daily routine of vigorous training. One morning, several months later... What? Graduation? That's right, graduation from the guild. If you graduate, you can leave the guild. You'll be rid of the harsh daily training program too. Of course, that all depends on your passing the graduation exam. Hey, 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 Chata! Hey, hey, I know, I, we've been around, yeah, I don't know how to talk. <laughs> oh, it's, it's never, it, it's, it's gotta be an episode where I can't talk. You know that it's gonna be good. We've been around a lot longer than those two. Hey, hey, why do Miel and Pele get to take the graduation exam before we do? They've already proven themselves to be worthy many times over. And after all, Miel and Pele did save the world. It's only natural that they, that they've earned the right to be tested. And that's how it goes. We will soon conduct the graduation exam. I expect you to be prepared for it. Laudra took the graduation exam last year. And promptly failed, hey, hey. G get lost! <laughs> so, what do we have to do for this graduation exam? I want you to explore the depths of a wood named Mystifying Forest. You should find a place called Luminous Spring there. Luminous Spring? Yup, it's where Pokemon once went to evolve. But maybe because of the time troubles we've had, no sunlight shines on the spring now. Now, nothing can evolve there. We want you to travel to Luminous Spring and return with its treasure. If you can bring that treasure back to the guild, you pass the exam. You will then be recognized as a fully trained exploration team, and graduate from the guild with full honors. Okay, we have to bring back the treasure. Let's do this, Miel! But, you have to watch out for one thing. There you'll find a frighteningly strong enemy. The Grand Master of All Things Bad lives there. The Grand Master of All Things Bad? Yup, the Grand Master is terribly wicked. It's a horrifying presence that no one would ever want to meet. So good luck with that! What? Huh, what? <laughs> that will do for the morning briefing. Alright everyone, let's get down to work! Hooray! Uh, Pele? <laughs> What'll we do, Miel? The Grand Master of All Things Bad? Hey, Loudred! Loudred, you took the graduation exam last year, didn't you? There's something we'd like to know. Can you tell us what the Grand Master of All Things Bad was like? Ugh, I'm sorry, I'm not allowed to talk about it. It's the guild rules. I can't talk about it. But I will tell you this. You're in for a dreadful, terrifying time. What I went through, even now when I let myself remember it- ah! Ugh, Loudred didn't tell us anything useful. We'll just have to do our best and graduate on our own. Let's go to Treasure Town and get ready. Yes. Let's do just- Wait, 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 Krogunk? Hello. Hey, you two. Graduation exam will put you through the ringer. Don't be flattened. Alright, let's see what you got, pal. Moon Jewel. Oh, we have a lava bow, I believe. Yes, we have lava bow ponder sash. None of these things, none of these things will do. But that's okay. Wait, what kind of missions do we have? These are all places that we haven't, we've unlocked through Spenda's Cafe, but haven't had the chance to get to yet. I think. Hmm. I was gonna say we might do some things off screen, just to get our rank up and get some. Missions suck. I don't want to go to fucking Apple Woods. Yeah, we'll take these guys. All right, we're gonna tackle the graduation in this episode, and if things.
things slow down in the next episode, then we'll be sure to do some things off screen. I didn't mean to run in here, but that's all good. That's all good? And what did I just say? Eh. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, Pele and Miel. Hi. Hey, Teddy Ursula Nursery. What's going on? Are you going out somewhere? Yep, we're going off to Mystifying Forest now. What? Mystifying Forest? But isn't it dangerous there? Haven't you heard? The Grand Master of All Things Bad is supposed to be there. Grand Master of All Things Bad? I've never heard of anything like that. You sure you're not m making a mistake? We go to play in Mystifying Forest often. We've never seen or even heard of a Grand Master. You must have misheard a bad rumor or something. Let's go. Bye! Also, I'm gonna turn down the music just a smidge. Just so it's not, like, super overpowering for my voice. That should be good now, I think. Hopefully. Something's not right. That doesn't sound anything like what Wigglytuff said. It's not as if we could do anything about it. Let's get ready and go out to Mystifying Forest. Indeed. I forget if Chansey had an egg. Nope, we don't have an egg. That is okay. Take some of that moonies. Also, um, there was a comment on one of my videos telling me what I should do for Miel and Pele's movesets, and I've got everything written down. I think off screen I might go through the dungeons and see what Pokemon know what, because for Mele, or oh, Mele, that's like their fucking ship name, what the fuck? I have like, I have everything written down, so I'm gonna put sketch on Miel, and then we're gonna go from there. But I'm gonna get everything ready, and then we'll head out for Mystifying Forest, so I'll see you guys in a second. So actually, one of the things I'm gonna do is I'm going to teach Flamethrower to our boy here. I think I'm gonna get rid of Fire Blast, because even though Fire Blast is nice, its accuracy isn't phenomenal. And also, Flamethrower is also long distance, so that'll be nice. I think he also learned Morning Sun, so I'm gonna put that back on him. What moves do you currently have? Yeah, so we'll put Morning Sun where Rock Slide is, and then the rest of this should be pretty good, I would say. Then we just gotta worry about Meow. That's gonna be the hard part, cause <laughs> it's, we're gonna have to like put Sketch over Roar of Time and do all of this bullshit, but it's gonna be great. It's gonna be good. I'll see you guys in a second. Did you hear the happy news? Why not? Thanks to everyone's recycling efforts, Project P recently made a new discovery! Hooray! This time, treasure was discovered, so we're offering a higher grade of recycled items! That's great news. Now give me the fucking prize ticket. Oh, gold ticket, I'll take that. <laughs> I think after gold ticket you get prism tickets, so that's nice. I'm just gonna sell my duplicates, seeing how... I really don't have any need for them. I can probably sell- I'm gonna sell the instruments, seeing how we're gonna be getting them anyways soon, so... Yes, let's see what we get. I'm gonna go blue, cause you guys are blue. Okay, fingers crossed. We have no fingers, but... God damn it. <laughs> what did we get? Oh, that's nice. I'll take that. Okay, goodbye! Alright, I'm gonna go put Morning Sun and Sketch on Miel and Pele real quick. I don't have any money. <laughs> oh, also, um, Pele got the... You wish to cancel? Yes. Cancel all plans. Pele got... Where is it? Sure Hit Attacker. Which means its regular moves will never miss, but I'm actually gonna turn that off since he has exclusive move user. Which isn't really gonna make much of a difference. Alright, let's see what you can remember. Yep, you can learn Morning Sun. Okay, um... Let me look at my uh, thing real quick here. Yeah, I'm gonna get rid of Rock Slide. And then we'll just turn that off. Like, until he actually needs to use it. And then... I will give Sketch back to myself. We're gonna put it over Roar of Time because it really hasn't been that useful for me. And the pausing is just not that good. Alright, 
seems good to me. Store our money. Got all of the things that we're gonna need. And then we're gonna head off to Mystifying Forest. Let's go! I'm actually gonna save real quick. Just in case the unthinkable happens. So we gotta keep an eye out for... Bubble, Poison Sting, Vine Whip, Powder Snow, Megahorn, Silverwind, or Bug Bite. So hopefully Mystifying Forest doesn't steer us wrong, because I don't think I've seen those moves yet. Let's head out. I am scared. Ah, oh, the music! This is the entrance to Mystifying Forest. I have no idea what we're gonna see in there, but this is our mission. Get to the deepest part of the forest and bring back the treasure. That's our graduation exam. Let's pass- let's pass this exam and graduate from the guild. Let's not blow this, Miel. Ooh! Oh, it's actually a forest. How nice. Oh, and I forgot I, I have the fucking map thing turned on. It feels so cheap. Wait, Ice Shard. It's not Powder Snow. That's okay. That's fine. Okay. We'll probably just blow through this dungeon. Oh, the music changes! I'm not picking up the instrument. Because we're gonna be collecting those eventually. Oh, what have you got? <laughs> if only fucking Weedle could learn that. Not that I have the money or anything, but you know. I'm hoping that we can... Conversion? I'm hoping that we can, like, see what moves these guys learn. That way we can... Hopefully try to get some decent moves on these guys. I mean Pele's pretty much all set But Miel's gonna be the one that's hard uh Oh, Avalanche, bye-bye Do I yeah, all I have is payday and Draco meteor, so we'll just keep using payday until it runs out I'm not gonna pick that up because we already have like a fucking wonder chest and miracle chest. Hypnosis! Nah. -uh. Wait, Pele is doing a really good job of not using Morning Sun. Huntail. Wow, I didn't take any damage from that. Never mind. I spoke too soon. Hello, Chikorita. You're actually normally in this dungeon. Got Pele's item! Hell no! That belongs to my friendo. Chinchu! Guys! It's Seth! <laughs> oh my god. I love this music, it's great. Hello. Do you have anything of use? Not that you're gonna let me see it. Also, I've been told to save up my ginseng, so I think that's what I'm gonna do. Flamethrower, look at that shit! Aeroblast! What are these crazy freaking moves? Hello. Facade. All great moves, but not moves that I need. Um, alright, back to the stairs. I'll let you guys know if anything exciting happens. In the meantime, let's blast through Miss Fine Forest. Fly! Oh fuck, Pele, get out of the way! Okay, that works. Oh, it's a price ticket. I'll curse snatch that. Yoink! That's a whole ass Absol. Aw, oh, damn it. Nice. Bodyguard! Bodyguard. Okay. Prize ticket, you are mine. Actually, I'm gonna give that to Pele. Yoink. <gasps> Hello! Oh my god, it died so easily! Oh, hello, oh my god. 
fucking sniping everything with flamethrower. Jesus. A chinchar that knows spatial rend. Jesus Christ. Goodbye. I was about to be like, oh, it's a cute chimchar, and then it frickin' destroyed us. I mean, not really, it only did one damage, but still. Fucking spatial rend. Oh, his big brother's here to fuck us up. All of these things are pushovers. I just want to see if you have good moves. Give me a good move. Oh, oh. I mean, that's nice, but... No thanks. Honestly, like, I could keep Payday. And just, like, try to get Powder Snow and slam! Oh, nice. It's about time you leveled up, damn. Alright, next floor. Meganium. That's a scary, per ugly. What the fuck? Dude. That's not cool. Good night and goodbye. My fucking furnace is really loud. Wait, fuck, oh, and shit, no! Oh. Hell, eh? Can you use Morning Sun? Oh, thank you. Wait, what do you mean? What do you mean it failed to affect me? No, Pele! Come on, man. Why'd you back up? I gotta turn that thing where he, like, fucking backs up off because that wasn't fun. Nor cool. Stop that. Okay, wait, I gotta turn that off. No, not tactics. What is it? Is it this one? Nope. Yep, that's it. Worry fighter goes off. Just screw that shit. Lost a frickin' reviver seed thanks to you, Pele. But Miel, I didn't mean it. <laughs> I didn't mean it, he says. Okay, well- Oh, listen, we still have three. We're good. I love you, Pele. Oh my god! Ooh! Hi. <laughs> it went down so easily. Um, I'll swap it that- I'll swap it that out. Oh, another one. Wait, quick attack. I could've fucking sketched that. Oh well. Oh my god, so many great items. I'll eat this. Actually, I'll give it to Pele. But I will eat this because I think my belly. Never mind, I died, so I don't need to abuse the system. Hello. Have you got anything useful for me? Oh my god, why did they die so easily? Hi, Badoo. Have you got any amazing moves? Or are you gonna die in like one hit or two hits? You coming, dude? Oh. Stop that. Thirteen floors. I think we're getting close to the end. And no cool moves yet, unfortunately. I hope- Okay, so I'm not gonna spoil the boss, but it is a monster house boss, so I'm hoping at least one of them have a cool move we can snatch. Oh, we're at the end. Mystifying forest clearing. I think we've come quite deep. Luminous Spring can't be too much farther. Oh, Pele, Miel! Hey, Teddy, your son nursing. You're here too. Yup. We often come here to play. So how's it going? Did you see your Grandmaster of all things bad? No, nothing like that. See? I told you you only heard a rumor. Why are you two here? Are you in search of that Grandmaster? 
No, we're not. We're searching for Luminous Spring. Oh, Luminous Spring? That's just up ahead here. What? Really? In fact, we were on our way there. Wanna come with us? Yeah, come with us if you want. Let's go with them, Miel. Wah! Ow, 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 ow. Th this is... Was that a pitfall trap? We fell down a pitfall trap. That's what happened to us. It looks like she's, like, looking up. What the hell? Ah, the hole! The hole's closing up! Wah! It's pitch black! I can't see a thing! Are we trapped? <laughs> what? Someone's here. Who is it? Who are you? Welcome to the world of darkness. I am the Grand Master of all things bad. What? The, the Grand Master of all things bad? <laughs> Not only the Grand Master, but more of us besides. A bunch of us minions are- A bunch of us minions of the Grand Master are here. You can't see us in the dark, but you're completely surrounded. <laughs> <laughs> Coming to our lair is the last mistake you will ever make. You are not walking out of here. Prepare to! Uh. What? Wigglytuff? And everyone else? What's going on here? H hey, Bidoof! Why'd you take the cover off? Uh, wh whoops. B but I thought it'd be too dark down there for y'all, so I opened it up. M maybe I did something I shouldn't have. Uh, helping out the graduation exam and all. This is all so new to me, I don't have the foggiest idea about what I should be doing. Ah, what a farce. Listen, Wigglytuff, can you please tell us what's going on? Who's Wigglytuff? What? I am the Grand Master. I know nothing of your so-called Wigglytuff. What? Uh, that's right. And we're the Grandmaster's minions. Oh my gosh, that is so right. I don't know any Pokemon named Sunflora. Hey, hey, hey. What's going on here? Coming to our lair is the last mistake you will ever make. You are not walking out of here. Prepare to face the terror that is the Grandmaster of all things bad. Yoomta! Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, so... As much as I want to see what moves they are, I don't want to risk anything right now. I am dark voiding everything. I do want to look for moves, but now is not the time. Now is definitely not the time. Uh, you know what? Ooh, look at that! Actually, while they're asleep, I might try to take out some flora as quick as I can. Uh oh. Ooh! Oh my god! Look at him go! Holy shit! If Wigglytuff can just like stay asleep. Oh my god! Look at us go! <laughs> Fucking overpowered Weedle! <laughs> oh, this is really funny to me. Oh, he's awake. Agility! Oh, fuck that shit. Oh, hell no. Bye, Corefish. Okay, now we just gotta worry about this asshole. No freaking way. Oh, bug buzz! Wait a minute! 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 Hell fucking yeah! It's not Bug Bite, but I'm getting it for that stab. Night night. You know what? It'll it'll do. It'll do for now until we can find something better. Uh I probably should have checked to see how well Bug Buzz would be, but everything's fine. Th they got me. Everyone run away. Ay! Squawk. Hey, hey! <laughs> I love them. Whew. What was all that about, I wonder? Well, I guess we're done here. Yeah, and I got a new move out of it. We should move on. Let's go to Luminous Spring. I know it's not Bug Bite, but it'll do for now. Alright, let's see what lays on ahead. Hey, Teddy Ursa Nursery. 
Oh, it's you. What happened to you two? I thought you were tagging along right behind us. Uh, something held us up. Anyway, what's going on? Well, see, there's a treasure box here. There wasn't a treasure box here before. I want to open it, but I'm also getting a creepy feeling from it. You know, it'd be nasty if it's a booby trap or something. So we've been debating whether or not we should open it or leave it be. Well then, we'll open it. You see, we got sent here for the guild's graduation exam. We were told to bring back the treasure from here. That's it. That boss must be something to do with your exam. You guys should open it. Can I get you to do this meal? Why? You don't want you don't want it fucking blown up in your face so I get forced to do it? I think it probably would be okay, but you never know it could be a trap. If I can get the dimensional scream to activate, that may give me a better idea if the treasure box is safer. Can I please talk without like tripping over my words? Miel touched the treasure box. The dizziness. The dizziness is starting. We haven't had a dimensional scream in a long time. Oh, hell yeah! Hi, Grandmaster! It was Wigglytuff that put this treasure here. That means, inside the treasure box, Miel opened the treasure box. This is... It's a perfect apple! The treasure of Luminous Spring. It was a perfect apple. Perfect apple is the treasure. <laughs> it suits Wigglytuff, I guess. What? Wha? What was that? Oh, the music! What? That? What's that? Light. Light is shining down. Oh, then maybe. Did Luminous Spring regain its power? Those that seek awakening. What? Who's saying that? The resumption of time has brought light here again. If you seek evolution, step forward. I knew it! I knew that Luminous Spring would be revived! Good for you, Teddy Ursa. You've been looking forward to evolution for a long time. Yup. Evolution? Oh, that's right, Wigglytuff mentioned it before. Luminous Spring? Yup, it was where Pokemon once went to evolve. But maybe because of the time troubles we've had, no sunlight shines on the spring now. Now, nothing can evolve there. Wigglytuff also said that this is where Pokemon would come to evolve. But what is evolution? Oh, you don't know what evolution is? What it means to evolve? Some kinds of Pokemon can evolve if specific conditions are first met. When a Pokemon evolves, its appearance changes, sometimes dramatically. Really? Your appearance changes? That's right. And it may not just be how you look that changes either. When you evolve, sometimes your form and abilities can even change. How about that? R really Yup. I've wanted to get stronger, so I've been hoping to evolve for a long time. I'll try it out right now. Those that seek awakening. This is Luminous Spring. Do you seek to evolve? Yup, please! Do you need an item to do so? Nope, I don't need one. So be it. Seeker of awakening, let us begin. Something is happening to Teddy Ursa. Teddy Ursa's appearance is changing. Teddy Ursa evolved into Ursaring. Wah! Teddy Ursa looks just like Ursaring now. Yay! Hey Ursaring, I've evolved. Congratulations. All the leveling up you went through finally paid off. Now it's hard to tell us apart, but good for you. Let's try evolving too, Miel. I'll try first. Those that seek awakening. This is Luminous Spring. Do you seek to evolve? Yes, I want to evolve. Please, oh, this is so exciting! Do you need an item to do so? An item? I don't know. Um, no, no item for me. So be it. Seeker of awakening, let us begin. No. Impossible. You may not evolve. What? Why not? Why can't I evolve? Is it maybe because I haven't met my requirements for evolving? No. That is not it. It is not merely a problem of not meeting requirements. Then why? Teddy Urso was able to evolve. Why can't I evolve? Why can you not evolve? It may be influenced by a distortion in the fabric of space. Distortion? In the fabric of space? Why that should be, I do not know. But your presence is somehow related to, this, to the distortion of space itself. And as a result of that, you cannot evolve. No, it is not only you. There is yet another. The one behind you is also forbidden its evolution. What? Miel too? What? Me too? 
That is all I can tell. This is Luminous Spring. If you seek new evolution, then you shall return. Well, that's a bit of a downer. Looks like it's not just me. I guess you can't evolve either, Miel. I don't understand why we can't evolve, though. Anyway, we have the perfect apple that was in the treasure box. We should go back to the guild with it. You've passed the graduation exam! Congratulations! You two have passed the guild's graduation exam! You did it! Oh? Not celebrating? Are you maybe not happy? Well, yes, I'm happy, but it hasn't really registered. I don't think we've accomplished anything that special. That's not true at all! Don't you understand what you two did was incredible? We went and brought back a fantastic treasure and a perfect apple! But even better than that, you defeated that horrifying Grandmaster of all things bad, didn't you? Ugh, but that's what I don't understand. Wigglytuff, how could you know that we defeated the Grandmaster of all things bad? Um, we heard it somewhere? Besides, that Grandmaster... Wigglytuff, wasn't that you? Huh? Uh, I... I don't know. I don't know what you're talking about. Grandmaster of all things bad? Me too! I know nothing! The Grandmaster's minions, what are they? Hey hey, me too! Eek! I don't know any minions! <laughs> Everyone, what's going on? Anyway, you two have now officially graduated from the guild. From now on, you will no longer be bound by the guild's strict regulations. You'll be free to operate as your exploration team totally on your own. I totally messed up what he was saying. Oh, right. Does that mean from now on we get to keep all the reward money from the board jobs and we don't need to share with the guild? That's excellent, Miel. No, unfortunately for you, that aspect doesn't change at all. Oh my god, wait, I feel a sneeze coming on. Never mind, I'm good. As before, you will still have to give most of that money to the guild. What? Why? Graduation from the guild means you're still affiliated with us. Your team, Team Slugbug, can operate only because of this guild, so you'll need to accept that as part of being an exploration team. Ugh. But I mean, it's not like anything has changed from before. Eek! You don't understand! Graduating from the guild is extraordinary! That's right! I should know! Even I couldn't pass the graduation exam! Ha 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 ha! Anyway, you two have passed the exam with flying colors. I hope you'll keep up your gra- <laughs> What the fuck was that? I like had a stroke! <laughs> I hope you'll keep up the great work as explorers. What the fuck was that? Wigglytuff. Congratulations, Ellie and Neil. Oh my gosh, how wonderful! Hey, hey, hey! I'm so happy for y'all. Um, um. Drop in on your old friends now and then. Everyone. Congratulations, Team Slugbug. They're throwing confetti all over us. Oh, everyone, thank you. Everyone. How wholesome. The Exploration Team Federation has sent a message. Miel's team was rewarded with an large treasure bag. You can now carry more items than you could before. Also, as a startup funds for newly affiliated teams, Team Slugbug received 10,000 P. One more thing. The special episode in the Future of Darkness has been unlocked. And actually, I think we're gonna save this special episode until the very end of the postgame, just so we can use this as the finishing, like, finale for the series. I think that sounds like a good idea. It'll be a great way to end things off. Congratulations, Team Slugbug! You graduated! That's the message I got as I crossed the fucking line on my graduation from high school! Oh, I fucking hate it. I hate how dorky I am. Since we can't use our old room at the guild anymore, let's live here from now on. This whole idea of graduating hasn't sunk in much yet, but let's keep going on as the exploration team like we always have. From now on, this is Team Slugbug's new exploration base. Let's head to the guild and check out the job bulletin boards and the outlaw notice boards. It's a new beginning for us, Miel! Exploration team quick advice. Because you've graduated from the guild, you may now- you may from now on save a record of your progress using the bed here. We're hugging. But anyways, I think that's gonna call it quits for this episode, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye! <laughs>